Today I was planning on doing a book review, um, but I've decided to change gears and kind of make a, a video screaming into the void. This is mostly for me, not necessarily what others will think or do, but if you happen to see it and agree with it, then I hope we can engage in a dialogue. I had the first good night's sleep in almost a week last night, and yet I woke up to see the horrific tragedy of, of Las Vegas and how one man in a matter of minutes destroyed tens of lives and horrifically changed the lives of thousands. Um, not just those who were injured, but also, you know, the families of those who died or were injured, or the, those who were at the same concert and didn't receive death or injury, their lives are forever changed, and those who care about them and their lives are changed. And I feel like we keep having, as a nation, we keep having the same conversation over and over, and we keep expecting different results even though we don't change anything. It's hard to have a conversation, though, when one side says, if you don't agree with me, you're against me, and another side says, well, if you don't agree with everything I say, you're against me too, and yet there are lots of us here in the middle saying, you can have guns, but we can still have better gun control and make sure that more lives are not lost in senseless violence. I don't know what will come out of the investigation. I hope there are some answers, but at the same time, I don't really know if I want to know those answers. I would rather we just come together and make some changes. And if you're grieving like me, I, I take heart in seeing all the people lining up for blood banks and all the mothers and fathers and s siblings and children who hold their family a little tighter tonight to say, I'm glad you're here. I don't know what to think moving forward, but I really hope that we finally change the dialogue that maybe somehow something good will come of this. And as, as Mr. Rogers said, you look for those who are helping, or I guess it's technically his mother who said that, but you look for the ones who are helping and I strive to hopefully be a helper. I heard a friend once say recently about the devastation in Puerto Rico. She said, you know, I have no money to give. I'm a very tight budget, but surely there's something I can do to help. So if you haven't reached out to do something, check around. I will try to see what I can do as well. Um, and you know, sometimes all you can do is just give a verbal support or help those out near you who are also contributing. So I hope we're able to come together and have a good discussion and, and bring about some peace and change.